Welcome to Wellness Explorers. Today, we're delving into a common health concern that affects many, swelling in the joints. Whether it's a temporary annoyance or a persistent issue, understanding the causes behind joint swelling is crucial for effective management and treatment. So let's dive into the top 10 causes of swelling in the joints. One of the most obvious causes of joint swelling is injury or trauma. This can include sprains, strains, or fractures, where the body's natural response is inflammation, leading to swelling around the affected joint. Arthritis is a broad term encompassing various conditions characterized by joint inflammation. Rheumatoid arthritis, osteoarthritis, and gout are common types that can lead to joint swelling, stiffness, and pain. Bursitis occurs when the small, fluid-filled sacs, bursae cushioning the joints, become inflamed. This inflammation can lead to swelling, tenderness, and restricted movement in the affected joint. Tendinitis involves inflammation of the tendons, the tissues that connect muscles to bones. When tendons become irritated or overused, they can swell, causing discomfort and restricted joint movement. Joint swelling can also result from an infection, such as septic arthritis. Bacteria, viruses, or fungi entering the joint space can trigger inflammation, leading to swelling, redness, warmth, and pain. Conditions like lupus and psoriatic arthritis are autoimmune disorders where the body's immune system mistakenly attacks its tissues, including the joints. This can result in chronic inflammation and joint swelling. Engaging in repetitive motions or overusing certain joints, especially in activities like sports or manual labor, can lead to joint swelling. This is often seen in conditions like tennis elbow or runner's knee. Excess weight places added stress on the joints, particularly those in the knees, hips, and ankles. Over time, this can contribute to inflammation and joint swelling, exacerbating conditions like osteoarthritis. Certain medications, including some used to treat high blood pressure, may have side effects that include joint swelling. It's essential to consult with a healthcare professional if you suspect your medication may be causing joint issues. Lifestyle choices such as poor diet, lack of exercise, smoking, and excessive alcohol consumption can all contribute to inflammation in the body including the joints. Making positive changes can help reduce the risk of joint swelling. And there you have it, the top 10 causes of swelling in the joints. Remember, if you're experiencing persistent or severe joint swelling, it's important to seek medical advice for proper diagnosis and treatment. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more informative content. Thanks for watching.